With two men already in custody and more arrests expected, investigators on Tuesday outlined the case they are building in the killing of 26-year-old Melissa Bartow. It was uh, what I would call a case that was not, didn't look very good at first, and now it has all come together, and uh, I think we have a pretty good case at this point. Investigators say Ishmael Ramsey, who is charged with killing Bartow, has refused to talk. But his friend, James Howard George, who is charged with conspiracy and abuse of a corpse, is cooperating with police. The crime scene was very horrific and dynamic in nature. Um, uh, there was substantial physical and forensic evidence at the scene. And, um, you know, at this point, based upon the jewelry, clothing, and some other characteristics, uh, we wholeheartedly believe that it is Melissa. With an autopsy pending, state police said they continue to pursue multiple suspects and expect at least one more arrest to be made. And I can tell you now, it's not done today just because people are in jail. We're going to make more arrests. We're going to continue the background investigation on this and uh, present the best case we can to the district attorney's office so they can um, do what's necessary. Bartow's family expressed anger at the way the case has been reported upon by local media and remembered her as a loving daughter and mother. She was a beautiful soul. She was a great mother. Whatever lies have been told about her is completely untrue. It's just unbearable that I have to bury my beautiful 26-year-old daughter who was funny, had a sense of humor, a beautiful smile, you know, cared about people, you know, just cared about her daughter, you know, cared about, um, you know, life and wanted nothing but the best for her daughter. This has been a Butler Eagle Report.